highlight to this APC instead of coming out with another tutorial. This is going to be a little different. It's going to have nothing to do with Game Maker. It's just that um, I want I want to show you guys how to get images from Minecraft since this is uh, if you're into Minecraft and you and you like making stuff in Game Maker and and this this might be useful to you and not everybody knows this so I thought you might want to know this. So in my previous tutorial stack of inventories I got images from Minecraft and those weren't rather than just copy going to the game and trying to look at it and try and copy best I can you can actually go into the to the um, on your computer and find where the files are saved and that's what I'm going to do right now so first off you go into your my, my computer and you click local disk C or whatever your main disk is and when you, once you're there you go down to users and then I'm going to click APC but you're going to click whatever your name is of whichever account you're using and then under AP APC or whatever account you're using, you go under a file called app data. But if you look at this, you can't see any file called app data. That's because app data is a hidden file. Windows makes hidden files because it stores all kinds of files that would only be used by programs, and they're fairly certain that it's never going to be used by human beings. So it's, it'll just make it look unorganized to have it here when it's never being used. So the way you would access it is click, click up here, and then you do slash app data so now we're inside that folder that didn't exist earlier so then we go into roaming and it's used by a bunch of programs as you can see here but the one that we want to access is minecraft then we go under bin and then this is where the everything's stored from minecraft and this is a special type of folder called a jar file which is I mean, something to do with java and you need a special program in order to open it the best way to go is use winrar which is the only free one I, free one I know of so you would right click click open with if this doesn't show up here you probably need to install it i'll put a link in the description and maybe put an annotation here as well to link you to where you would download it once you download and installed it if it still doesn't show up here Click Choose Default Program, Browse, then under Pro it by default goes under Program Files, but if it doesn't go there by default, you can just um, copy the the directory I have here. So look under Program Files, see if you find it here. If it's not there, then go under Program X86, means you have a better processor and it can handle this. So then you scroll down until you see WinRAR, and there we have it. And click on that, and you simply click on this right here and you click open and that's how it goes so right click open with webinar okay officially it's the demo version but there's no advantage to buying it so you just close out every time so this is a lot like windows explorer and here are all everything that has anything to do with minecraft you can see all these class files right here they contain all of the coding and stuff that's where all that is so you can see the majority of it is class files but there's also some images like like these ones so some let's go into the title just, just to give you an example this Motion at PNG. This is the logo that shows up in the beginning every time. You can change this around and make it some other look if you so wanted to. And then here's the Minecraft logo on the main screen. And then this is also pretty interesting. Splash.txt. Um, you know how uh, once you get to the Minecraft page and the, the, the main Minecraft my main screen, um, there's like a random text that shows up next to the logo. Well, all those texts are stored in here. I, I'd open it, but no pad isn't working for me for some reason. But but if you take, just take my word for it, if you open it, it'll have a whole list of different words that are completely random, and that's what makes up the list that the random words in the game are chosen from. So you can modify that list if you so wish and um, surprise your friends with that. If you go under mob, you get all the textures used for the animals and stuff. So let's see if you go under pig, that's the right for pig. Where's creeper? There's creeper. That's what creepers are. And that's how creepers look like in the texture. So, so those are just some fu fun ones you need to know that you don't need to know. But those are just some fun ones that most of you probably aren't, me may, may not make use of. But just another fun fact is that whenever you install a texture pack, all it's doing is replacing these images with images made by other people. And same goes for all of these images. So if you go into GUI. And items. This is probably one of the ones that you will find useful. These are all of the items in Minecraft. So you, they got the whole arsenal of every type of weapon and everything. And this is this one point. So you see the, the drawing back bow animation right here as well. And then there's the terrain right right here, just in the in the main folder under terrain. These are all, all the different terrains 
in the game and if you don't see it right here you probably have your folder um, organized differently like right here now I, I would type to ascending and then you can change it to descending and so now now those terrain stuff doesn't don't show up up here anymore they show up all the way at the bottom so that's I actually had a lot of trouble finding it when I was figuring out this tutorial so that, that's where that is from here you can just o open it up and save it somewhere else and then you can edit it to your liking and, s and save it there and you can modify Minecraft to make it and make it personal to you or you can load the files and use them in, use them in game make or blender or whatever it, can, it, can, it possibly is limitless, limitless so I hope you found this useful please rate comment I, I'd say subscribe but if you've liked this video I'm not can't guarantee you like my other videos because most of the other ones are nothing like this so, but if you so wish, you can check out my channel and see if you are into the Game Maker. Sounds fun, and I, I know Game Maker. Alright, so see you guys next time. Bye.